Now he's in the showers, just like in prison, <laughs> Moses. You've got to be careful. <laughs> <laughs> Never know what can happen. Cash is so it's close so now. Incredible. Oh, where's the knife? And... Cześć, witajcie moi drodzy, w dzisiejszym materiale przedstawię wam film, kiedy Virtus Pro miał status legendy CSGO. A ty jeżeli chcesz często oglądać moje materiały, to pomóż mi wbić pod tym wideo 1000 w grę i już jutro wrzucam dla was kolejny film. Jak to zwykle u mnie bywa, do wygrania skoska Good Knife, niebieska stal Minimalware i aby wygrać trzeba subskrybować kanał razem z dzwoneczkiem, zostawić łapkę pod tym materiałem, polekować mój fanpage, zafollowować mnie na Instagramie oraz napisać komentarz z godziną, o której widzisz ten film. Napisz w komentarzu, czy kiedyś wróci stare, dobre Virtus Pro, a ja przytnę serduszko. I każda łapka w górę pod filmem, jak i na moim fanpage'u, to jest Jeden grosz dla Amelki Holej na raka. Link do akcji macie oczywiście w przypiętym komentarzu, a teraz zapraszam już do oglądania. Trzymaj się i hej! Szukasz drużyny do wspólnego grania albo kumpli do MMA? Dzięki dreamteam.gg jest to możliwe. Szukaj, włącz się, zarządzaj i zarabiaj realne pieniądze. Zdobywaj doświadczenie i zostań profesjonalistą. Dołącz już dziś. Dreamteam.gg Three sets of armor, raid boss in the form of Flamey and maybe there's a straight up B-Rush, all five players committing to the upper platform here, let's go. Pasha immediately taken down, Guardian's got the start required for Na'Vi, but Bialy pops out late, second headshot potentially there, ooh, Guardian does damage. But he comes out worse for wear in the end, Neo gone, Guardian wraps back around, then it's gonna be Bialy down in the end to just Snacks. Does find one, oh, no. let's not leave him out of this. The Big Apple and Snacks is hungry. He's got one kill already on the USP. Low HP as well on Guardian and Flamey. He's trying to bait them out, trying to get them into one-on-ones as he dances back and forth between the box. What a shot on Simple! Oh, Guardian, bye-bye! And it's on to Flamey. He's tapped it. Flamey's got a big... What in God's name is that from Snacks? Unbelievable! I've never seen anything like it. What the hell was that? Only Pasha remains now. Going to get at a close frag on the P250, though. Doesn't have the bomb, however. So advantage Copenhagen Wolves. It's an expensive round for them as well, but they should be able to afford a full buy in the following round. Pasha with a minute to play with here. Going to take a completely different approach. Yeah, and this is obviously quite winnable for Pasha with 50 seconds left. He just has to get a couple of headshots. Of course, you know, you can't afford to really have a fight that's prolonged because of that lack of Kevlar. It will just be the death of him. So he's got to get an instant kill here. And he might get a free one. Oh, my goodness. He's... Hunden is not looking. This is so horrendous. He's looking for the next player now. If you can get information on where the next player is, this is fantastic here from Pasha. He can even keep moving. And there it is. He can spot the next player. Oh, my God, Pasha! How did how did they not? Oh, it's just unbelievable. What do you say to that, James? What, what, what a do you way say to that? To the call has been made. Now, where do you go from here? And oh my God, they haven't stopped moving. Three members of VP have got their running shoes on, and they are just doing some cardio between the two sites. But it looks like Fnatic are about to make their presence known. Just Taz and Bialy ready to stand the test. How quickly can VP get there? How quick can the cavalry arrive? It doesn't look like quick enough as Pronax oh finds Snacks. Oh my god! Oh, Pasha! Oh in four seconds! And now Flusher with an all to do. You blink and you miss. going down. What are we witnessing now? Neil, the last one left. You know, one on four. Dignitas deciding it is not over yet. They want to fight and they want to continue to battle into overtime. And the money for Virtus Pro is they lose this round, which it certainly feels like they will. They're going to have just as bad a situation as Dignitas just did. I'm so surprised that Dignitas got away with that. They've done this before with assault rifles. VP were just sat in positions where no one was watching the fountain. Neo very nearly lands a second one. Will through the wall. And now with this smoke, he can get the bomb planted. The problem is, Dignitas have a lot of grenades still at their disposal. Kevlar and AKs. So, we've seen Neo pull off clutches. We know this guy is an unreal talent. Can he put that talent to use? They have two smokes left, and that's a really big problem for Neo, because he has a Molotov, and I bet he would love to use it to buy time, but they've already smoked out the bomb. There's another headshot coming through. He'd have to go for the ace clutch into winning the semi-finals here looking for another spray. Neo's gonna get it. He goes for more. Spray for the one. He's out of bonus. Neo! Are you kidding me? He picks it up. Ace clutch right into the grand finals. And 
Fiali is still alive. Not for much longer, just on Neo. And he has four players to find and frag. There's one. There's a second one. And the fact that Rubino is low now makes this possible. He's actually done for the ace as well. So there's so many accolades that Neo could be picking up for himself. Can he get this? Yes, he can. He's going to get the fourth one. And now it's all on Rubino, who must be wondering what's happening, Neo. He clutches. Unbelievable. There's no way they were going to retake that 2v5. And I don't know how anyone... I don't know why Pasha thought it was a good idea. They had no control over jungle anymore. Connector was completely lost by that point. Sure, Neo was still up and Taz was still up, but they had n zero vision, zero angles held. So he just goes up on the ticket booth and there you have it. You got, what, two or three players coming through. And wait, what is this? No, no. way. Snacks. No, They're so snacks. far away. Are you serious right now? Play of Phase. century. Oh, oh my god, god Snacks. A bulldozer, that is Neo. And... Gali, oh, you would have bet your house on him hitting that frag. Forrest picks him off. It, uh, he is down in the end by Taz. They're a man to the good here, Virtus Pro. But uh, that is massive. But Snacks is walking around and just walking in a Snacks Wonderland. He oh. gets it off the hand trick of frags. He waited, he waited, he waited, and then he finished off the job. Oh. You just had to wonder when was he going to pull the trigger? Repeat. And Snacks will be the man that'll lead this push in. And he'll get a headshot on to get right. And they're four frags away from victory now. It's Freiburg still in there, though. Freiburg's not gone. And he will show himself at the right moment, which is a headshot on to Bialy. He will eventually go down at the hands of Pasha. They're three frags away now, Virtus Pro, as they will move the bomb in. And it'll be Fifth Laren and Exist to come charging in. And Snacks to go mowing them down. One more will do it for Virtus Pro. It's all on Forest. He gets the first. He doesn't get the second. Man. MBK, your thoughts on that win? That was just a masterclass from First Pro. Look at that, they are extremely happy, and I think they are even happier knowing that they party all play NIP. That was an immense game, and look at that, the whole crowd is a whole standing invasion. Maybe not the problem, but that's just the difficulty that operas go through on that T side is no matter what what happens, like there you're just gonna have some halves where you just don't get any of the fights you want, you don't get the time. Ta or I oh, mean God. Snacks Snacks giving the stare. Adrian with a frag of his own, and now Pash is trying to make amends for that previous mistake with two quick fire headshots and a bit of deja vu, except much better in Gambit's favor. He's going to get a chance to essentially do a do over here. Flash has come through there through the gate. He's going to pick up one kill now. It's a one on one. He's got the triple and he just needs one more tap here onto space. And of course, it has to be space again. Oh my God. It's going to be Pasha picking up the quad kill and Versus Pro making it to 15. For Neo, the bomb will be planted. And now it's a four versus three for the retake here. Get right out in the open, isolated, trying to reload. And he will have time for it. Draken shooting stacks in the back. Bialy goes down, and now Neo. One versus three. He gets a headshot on Draken, and he's got the bomb in his position, looking for more takedown for a sprite. And Neo with a triple, taking down a third in get right. And now it's just coming in for the final kill. It's Neo with the ace, shutting down all of NIP. Unbelievable. Out to the back of the side to hit some shots, and he won't be able to do it. This is Bialy left in a one on three. Bomb is planted. No utility on either side, on which means he's got a clean peek and he's got the Molotov down. He's going to burn one. He's going to pull this off by way of flames and wildfire. They'll burn alive and Virtus Pro take map one just barely. Fourteen HP over towards CT, holding a very passive angle though, not going to be expected. So now Bialy, one on three, he has been known in the past for his incredible clutch rounds. A little bit quiet perhaps on this map here, just chiming in with a kill here and there, but maybe going to come alive here as he seems to be savvy towards the connector position, actually finds the head of Dennis and now knows his one over towards CT. <gasps> Find Draken as well. Will he be ready for Reds to be there? The Flash surely going to give it away as he turns around. Oh. And he finds the head, takes it 16-14 for Virtus Pro. I certainly was not expecting that. 
The aggression continues here from Hellraiser. Dead Fox going to get that bomb down, but Bialy's oh. lined up three quick kills, and oh my goodness, that is Pro propelled back into this retake with all the force in the world. It's Angel wrapping round from behind. It has to try and make all the difference. Dead Fox has and to. Smoke's available here for the CT side, but Neo's got one himself, buys himself a little bit more time there. And this is looking out of reach. I don't think this is worth going for. Flashbangs are good from the Virtus Pro side. Now they're going to be challenging for the frag. Still four kills to find on the face side. Spamming the smokes. They'll get one. It's up to Rain now to deliver a godlike performance. There's two frags. Goes with a 10 second defuse. He's the only player about a kid as well. They've got to fight back here. One kill will do it. It's okay. Oh, take the Virtus Pro. Deliver through the smoke. Neo with a double spray down. Make it three. As caught by Guardian. You shall not sneak by and you shall not succeed in holding off the rotations. It's Snacks that has to do so. One versus two and Guardian still on that AWP. Snacks with the same weaponry, but a close position from Edward is going to force him, funnel him out, but he finds the shot! A lovely shot, and then a Guardian! And oh my god, Snacks, have you ever just stolen it from- Dying to a grenade, but Pasha going to be sneaking in no scoping, FNX, and now Fur, that 1HT grenade from Pasha could settle this round that would be so painful for the SK team. Sneaking down, trying to stay in the back lines, Fur doesn't want to get spotted. Pasha's very close, making a little bit of noise, and oh my god, he gets that shot! Absolutely ridiculous, and that's going to be the round versus Pro. Him down though, and he picks Neo off in the drop zone after Neo takes his play, then oh, Pitt, he can't afford to miss these shots. They know he's on the fountain area, almost gets two for one! Slows down. Oh, get right. He's the snake in the grass. But he's gonna. Oh my. Oh my god. No, but you can't. What is this kind of nonsense? How do you want 80 like that? Oh god. Oh. Is that Shiner's actually gonna go for the spray through the smoke? That's gonna open Bialy, though, for Lecro as he rotates in through CPL and a 1v3 situation for Snacks. Finds one. Two. Oh, Snacks! Snacks, what are you doing? Lecro, you know where he is. Oh, he's got to jump. Does he go high ground? Does he go low ground? That's not short. There we go. The jump comes in, but how did he defuse the bomb? Oh, he's got a cover for it. Snacks, you got to be fast. you got to be fast. Lecro's coming back out again. In his face! How are you doing this? Do anything in their back on pistols to try and stave off match point. They, they just have eagles and tech lines here. Oh, no. And there's the kill from Neo taking down Magus. It is not looking good. They're trying to see if they can get down, but they're standing on top of the fire and getting shot for the smoke. And Bialy here to block him off with a smoke waiting. Cajun goes down. Bialy again. He does it with a third coming in. And that's the that kill. Welcome to the Virtus Pro Apocalypse. They're one round away from making it to the semi final. I ain't seen him but I haven't checked it just yet. He's still going to go ahead and thinks he's cleared things out. Looks right at him. Snacks. Not Snacks. Neo takes himself too. One versus one now, has himself an AK. This is a round that never should have come this close. And Neo, big side defuse one. Oh. Here's a, starts to pick up through short, and Neo finds the frag, wins it out in the 1v1. And seemingly from Gundam no... does a lot of damage, but they've lost all of Meister. And now Crim's got to make sure they don't come out of drop. If they can take him down, this bombsite is lost, and they're just going to run him over. Taz with the armor and the Mac... Oh, sorry, the, the Tech-9 there. Easy couple of kills for him, or the one kill and Flusher. Now, one versus five. He's even being ring around the Rosie here. Pasha's waiting. Oh, don't do it. Pasha, that's so cruel. He knifes Flusher. And that will be it. And there's the answer from Seize as he just waits patiently. Snacks walks into it. Simple. Follow it up, but hold on, it's not done just yet. Low HP, Taz has picked up another kill. Bombs in the open, they've got a cross to grab it, and that means Simple doing so. With 8 HP though, he can't pour, pour to go. AK picked up. Taz, is he gonna pull this back as well? 15 HP only. Snacks is able to capitalize, but in doing so, he leaves himself distracted. And therefore, Phelps gets the refrag. Oh. Nice shot from Taz. Cold down, gives him the bomb plant. Very important that he gets it, but Phelps is aggressive. I'm impressed with how aggressive he's been in this series. Certainly warming up to the fact that he's on SK and he's got a teammate directly beside him. Taco work together, but they don't go at the same peak. Oh, oh Taz! <laughs> the devil strikes and Taz ties the game. Pasha knows that he can push. Snacks covers off the lower tunnels and they've got all the map control. Pasha's in behind them. They're locked down in this hallway. They've got to kill Snacks just to get anywhere further on the map. He pops out. He's got no support in the duel, no trade potential. So he's got to get them on his own. He's got one. Wait a moment, they're both out of ammo. It's going to be a knife for Snacks to start it off. So many knives in this tournament and on this map as well. Three on three. Bialy holding an angle where 
He may only be able to get headshots on Smith here. It's not necessarily easy, but so much time is already off the clock here. G2, where's that retake gonna come from? Neo somehow staying alive and fighting shocks in the meantime. He gets a headshot on Pasha now. Neo turning around, he's locked in the corner. He can't do much, he's gonna get one shot. Gets a headshot on Shox, he's reloading. He's getting the chance, Smith has to find him. And it's gonna be right now, Neo! Oh my God, Smith's forced oh, to So right now, just looking for a bomb plan that would be great. Get a bit of a money bonus so they could buy even more stuff in the next round. Grenade can land right at the feet. Oh my god! Pasha! A nuclear bomb exploding Doja, Hobbit, and Mo, and that's gonna be the end of the round. Snacks is Zach Zach is a feeder zobaczymy tam akcję. Zobaczmy. Snacks zdiglem jednak. Ustawione na blisko. Terroryści poczekają na flesza. Snacks przez to jednak widzi. No i już Snacks zaczyna swój taniec. Czekają na niego zawodnicy terrorystów. Obity kolejny zawodnik. Snacks jeszcze dwie. Kule, czy może dwa strzały już zostały? Zdecydowany na Snacks, Snacks, no i ten Nate będzie zabójczy, nie! Oj, tak! Co ten Snacks teraz zrobił? New angles. Further and further back. Further. He creeps around the side of the train. Important play from Fur. He's still deep amongst the enemy lines. He will eventually be taken down, but did he do enough damage? Perhaps not. Girl, he's back in there. And now it is going to rest onto Taco. Onto what? Smallin gets himself two in a row, leaving just Neo. Ooh, it's so tight, but he can't find the angle. Spots it, but Neo, how have you done this? Taco in connector. Does he know where Taco's coming from? He's holding the angle very, very tightly indeed. Taco the crowd pig. It's not good enough. He dinks him down to AHP, but Neo survived. Towards the CT spawn area. Successful. There it is. The MBK frag. I always said it. it comes in most of the time. And now they make their way towards B. But Neo will be trying to shut this down. Body will look it's around. Bomb. Bomb no. is gone. Taz has it. Body looks around to watch for the flank bomb. They've got to go back for it. But it's down to just Taz. Where is he gone? Where is he covering the bomb from? They didn't oh, read the flash! God, they didn't seconds. read the flash! It's an indubitable double, and now they're in trouble because the time is gone. First ball wins it. Taz does it on a flank. He looks as cool as a cucumber. He's put that to use. He's one of those players that absolutely can. Pash has taken a bit of damage early on, but this should be Norse chance to just equalize the score. Oh, he's hiding right at the edge of the smoke. Konfig doesn't know it. Snacks trying to sneak up behind him. Konfig not really aware of what's going on yet. This could be a lost AK very quick, and the timing here is favoring Snacks. And is he really going to go for the knife? Oh my god! He takes down Konfig with a knife in the quarterfinals with everything on the. Just an actual Terminator. Triple here. And looks oh, like it's gonna yes. be. Is it gonna be? Papa. I mean, this is psychological warfare, isn't it? He's flashed for a moment accidentally. And he's just <laughs> hunting for Hobbit. Now he's in the showers, just like in prison, <laughs> Moses. You've got to be careful. <laughs> you never know what can happen. Pash is so close so now. Incredible. Oh, where's the knife? And there yes, it is. Hobbit is gone. The quad kill with the knife. Damage done. He takes down Pasha, but he can't do any more than that. The defuse will come through, and VP won't be able to deny the bomb plant. They will be able to get the retake and claim the lead away from the priority side. Wait. 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 Whoa. Is that enough? Has he still got this? No, he doesn't. Oh my god, Neo! Oh my god! No! Oh my god!